Hey, what's going on? It's your boy back at you with another video. So, Los Angeles lose tonight uh, off a of buzzer beater, 116 to 115. Andrew Newmhart, Newmhart, um, hit a um, buzzer beater to beat the Lakers. So the Lakers fall to seven and twelve on the season. And um, I want to say this, man. I want to say that even though they lost tonight, there's plenty of things that they can build on from this. That they played well tonight. They just didn't finish. And they can build on this going into the uh, Portland game on Wednesday night. But um, good win. They just got tired. I think that um, in the next game, I think that uh, Darvin Ham should have took him Braun out because he looked like he was tired. And um, they played a hell of a game. They just got to know how to finish. But they're 7-12. and 12. Com Compared to being 2-10, and 10, I think the team has improved. They lost, what, Six, but they were only well lost, what, six out of the last eight games? So, I mean, off of basically a lucky shot. But I just think that they need to work on playing defense on, on shooters because a lot of, you know, Miles Turner was left open. You can't keep leaving three-point shooters open. And they just set, they, would, they had time to set their feet. It's just little minor things that they can work that um, Darvin Ham and the Laker coaching, coaching staff, they could just um, look at the film and just make little minor adjustments. But they played as hard as they could. Russell Westbrook hit timely shots. Um, they played well tonight. They just, they just, they got it. They got to learn how to finish. And if they don't learn how to finish, um, this season could be a, a real hard one. But um they played well tonight. They 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 lost. But I don't know where everybody's coming from that, you know, that yes, Brian played sloppy in the end, you know. But at the end of the day, he did they were they doing the best that they could do. And I know that's something that that you don't want to hear and I know it's a lot of more there's no, there's no more victories in pro sports, but they can build on this. That things like that doesn't happen. The Lakers had that game wrapped up, but all they gotta do is just finish. That's all they gotta do is finish. They learn how to finish, they'll be all right. But they was right there. They was right there. They just gotta finish. I'm not gonna say nothing bad about Brian. Cause that's what you know what? That's what you guys want people to do. You probably thought that, oh, he's gonna come here and say something bad. No, I'm not gonna say nothing bad because they played great. They didn't get blowed, they didn't get blowed out. They had a 17 point lead. They were dominating this game. This game should have been over. But they got to learn how to finish people. That's all they have to do is learn how to finish people, learn how to make minor adjustments down the stretch, and they will be all right. But 7 and 12, I'll take that. Compared to being 2 and 10, I'll take that. But see, you guys thought that I was just going to come in here and take a dump on this team. I'm not doing that anymore. You got to think positive, man. And all that negativity... What good is that? What good is that doing? What is that doing? Yeah, it's great for the ratings because a lot of people hate LeBron James anyway. A lot of y'all hate this man. Y'all despise LeBron James. You just don't like the man. But at the end of the day, you have to understand, okay, that um that they didn't get blow. If they got blowed out by thirty points or something, that's something different. But the game was in reach. It's just, it's just things happen. It's called basketball. 
that they they got to stop leaving three point shooters open. Work on that. Um, down the stretch, Bron got to take smarter shots and go to the basket. And that's all I was. That's all I'm saying. But I'm not gonna say nothing bad and degrade this man because we got a lot of people degrading this man. And I, I seen that little video tonight. That old boy said that he's officially done. How's how is that Kareem record? What does that Kareem record have to do with LeBron James? What does that have to do with him? Things happen. It's called basketball. All they have to do is make minor adjustments. It's no big deal. They got the um, they got the, the Trailblazers Wednesday night, and I think they got the Bucks Friday night in Milwaukee because they got a, a five. I think they got like a a five what game West Coast East Coast trip. So. Y'all thought I was going to say something bad. No, I'm not going to do that. Because that's all people... That's all people want to do, man. All we want to do is sit around and hate and tear this man down. I'm not going to keep tearing him down. Because it's just minor things that they can work on. But they're perfectly fine. Everybody played well tonight. It's just It just happens. You have to finish... And that's all they have to do. But I'm not going to come up here and take a shit on this team. I'm not doing that anymore. But all y'all do is just sit around because y'all just don't like this man. You don't like this man. That you talk about you wish he retired and all this foolishness. Because you're, never, you're not a Laker fan anyway. A lot of you guys are not Laker fans. You don't like the man. And it's just plain... It's just blatant hate. You guys are nothing but a bunch of haters, man. And where is that hate getting you? Tearing this man down. And that's all that's all people can do. It's pure hate. I mean, I heard I heard that video tonight talking about it about the scoring record. That has nothing to do with it. It's called minor adjustments. Delvin, Delvin Ham, Del, Darvin Ham has them playing right. All they got to do is work on, work on, look at the film, collapse on three-point shooters. Don't let them breathe the next game. Um, kind of give Brown a blow, like start of fourth quarter. You had him up by 15. Take him out for about maybe three or four minutes. Then put him in like the final eight so he can be fresh and ready to go. Brian had a good game. AD had a great game. Um, Russ played very well tonight. The whole team played well. They just, it's just a lucky shot. Things like that don't happen all the time. So it's nothing to panic about. They're playing well. Seven and twelve, I'll take it. But at the end of the day, that's all you guys want to do, because you guys, I'm just, I'm just convinced that you guys just don't like LeBron James anyway. Y'all hate this man, and all you want to do is just tear people down, and it's sad. They did not play well tonight. They, I mean, they did not win tonight, but they played well. That's all you can ask for. Is effort. At least that's one thing that I'm giving this team credit, that they're playing with effort. They're playing their hearts out. They just fell short. It's called life, ain't it? Every time this man lose, they want to go make all these stupid-ass videos because they just don't like the man from the beginning. It has nothing to do. They could have won this game, and they, they still would have had something to complain about. You know, the same guy that says that he's officially done with Bron, he's been done with him anyway. Cause him all, he calls them all kind of bitches and, and 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 pussies anyway. So I mean, let him eat, go make your videos and keep crying. But where's that crying getting you? It's getting you nowhere. You can stay mad or you can get glad. It's just that simple. 
They just have to work on the minor adjustments. But, sir, where is all this emotional? Why are you so emotional? What is it to be emotional about? They played well tonight. They're not getting blowed out. They played well. What else do you guys want? They're giving um, Lonnie Walker, um, Austin Reeves, Gabriel. They're they're playing their hearts out, man. What else do y'all want? They don't have a lot of talent. But they play, they're playing hard. They're playing hard every night. It ain't like they just got ran off the floor. So what's the what's the what's the what's really the beef? Because you guys just don't like this man anyway. You guys ain't nothing but a bunch of haters, man. And it's sad. Talking about the Kareem, that ain't got nothing to do with it. They need. They just didn't close out. They didn't close out on them three point shooters. They gotta, they gotta get, they gotta get buckets. Brian gotta get them buckets the last few minutes of the game, and you could have iced the game. They playing where they played through AD. They're playing all right. They're they're right where they need to be. They just gotta close out ball games, and they can they can do this. They can do this. So, but that's all that hate that y'all be doing. Y'all so emotional. Like, come on, man. Y'all a bunch. Y'all act like a bunch of Carl Thomas, man. I'm emotional. Stop being so emotional, man. Oh boy, about to have a heart attack, man. Man, I'm I'm officially done with this dude because you just don't like him no way. You don't like this man. You don't like Anthony. You don't like the Laker team. You don't like him anyway. But you know, if you come off hating, then that, that's that's good for the vi- that's cute for the videos, but if you're a real fan, why not make adjustments? All you talk, all they talk about is emotion. Take the emotional out the game. Take the emotion out the game. You can't. And they're just saying like, I, I I look at these videos. It's just like these people are too emotional, man. You about to have a heart attack. You going? You you fighting? You, let's say you fighting, you know, I'm going to get back to the video, but let's say you're in a boxing match. You can't come out there all, all, all aggressive. You got you to gotta have a strategy. And that strategy of come making all these emotional videos yeah, is great for the views, but it makes you look like a jackass. It makes people look, emo- you look emotional, it made you look weak tonight. I ain't going to say who it is, but it was, that video was weak as hell. They didn't get blowed out. They lost by one point. What are you talking about? Oh, he's he he. Every time you turn around, you want to use that record because it's an excuse. It's a way to tear this man down. They are playing better. What the fuck more do y'all want this team to do? Because y'all just don't like them anyway. It's sad, man. Now all we can do is tear each other down all the time. I'm sick of that shit, man. That's what's wrong with the black community. That we we never we all we do is build but never take all we do is we never build, all we do is tear. And you wonder why we fucked up as a people. He over there making all these stupid and I know you I know um I know um donation TV, I know he gonna have a field day with this shit tomorrow. Cause they're a bunch of fucking haters. They want this team to fail. That's that's what a man they setting up their channel to fail. They're setting up so so he, they can get money off of him because they know as soon as, as he lost tonight or tomorrow he's gonna have full five hour live screen. Bitching and crying. Instead of coming up with solutions. That's what real people do. Real people come with solutions. Why don't you break the game down, sir? They ain't gonna say no they name, but they know who they are. Y'all know who I'm talking about. Making that emotional ass, weak ass video. It makes you look like a pussy. All that fucking crying. I thought you was a Chicago Bull fan. Why are you making all them Lake them Laker videos? What to buy more Mac, uh, Big Macs? Shit is sad, man. They did not play what they did not play that bad tonight. They had they had they had that game wrapped. And you can take that 
you could take that and just say, okay, we could build on this. Okay, Portland coming next 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 on Wednesday night. Come out there, jump on them, and then you got this five game road trip coming up. Come on, man, y'all kill me, man. Y'all they be killing me with that bullshit. Make up every kind of excuse just because you just don't like the damn man. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, I'm tired of people, and this might sound crazy, but I'm tired of people using LeBron James as a punching bag. I'm sick of that shit. Because your life fucked up, so you want to keep taking it out on somebody else? Ain't nobody got no strategy. All y'all want to do is talk about, well, he 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 a quitter. He 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 cares about his stats. He cares about this. He cares about that. They just fell short. What is to talk about? They didn't get blowed out. Because that's how you feel. Because it's emotion. Because that's how you feel. The heart never lies anyway. Because you're angry. Because you never really like, you never liked this man anyway. Then, sir, you said that, I'm just, and I'm being nice about it, okay? Sir, you talked about how when they played that game Wednesday, Saturday night, they beat the Spurs, right? Then a lot of people say, well, they barely won, but they won. He scored, Brian scored 39 points. 80 didn't, 80 didn't, 80, 80, 80 didn't play. And they still won. And yeah, they would have won this game tonight. Y'all would have had nothing to say anyway. Because when they win, you don't say shit. Quiet as hell. Because, oh boy, he normally do live screens. Why he doing no live screens tonight? Because they playing well? Because it, go, it goes against your narrative. You love, you want to see Bron lose. Because when he lose, you make more money. It's all about the money. I don't really think you hate Bron. I think that's an Oscar... Sir, I'm going to say, sir, you need an Oscar performance for that. Because you're a performer. You're an actor. We need we need, we need, need people to break the game down. Not be all emotional, acting like a little girl. Making all these emotional videos. I'm done with him. So? You done with him? Why you keep? You ain't done with him. Because you can't stop talking about him. Because if you know you stop, if you stop talking about Brian, you don't get no views. So why are you sitting up saying, well, I'm, I'm, I'm done, I'm done. And why keep talking about him? If you ain't got nothing to good, I'm just, I'm, I'm to the point like this. If you ain't got nothing good to say, why record it? Your life fucked, it, it just shows you that only hurt people hurt people. And I'm not the biggest LeBron James fan. But I'm just so tired of y'all taking a shit on this man. This man can't go to the bathroom and take a shit without motherfuckers got something to say. The Lakers could win 10 games in a row and y'all Negroes are still find something to complain about because you just don't like the man. And I don't really think you hate LeBron. I think it's just all performance. It's all a game. You're doing this because you know half of America, you know half of YouTube don't like him anyway. They don't like they don't like this man. So if you you come off like yeah, I, I see the game, but y'all just don't see it. The half of these guys is all I act. I don't really think they because think about it. If you really like some, if you didn't like somebody, you don't talk about people. You don't talk about people you don't like, right? You love this man because this man is putting you making all them videos. Why you think you got over thirty thousand subscribers? I ain't gonna call their name. Because you know you know people hate LeBron. Why you think Dreamers Pro got over a hundred thousand? No hate. Because he made all them LeBron James videos. He was a Clipper fan at first. Why he don't talk about the Clippers no more? You hopped off that he hopped off that bandwagon because he seen that bread. That's all it's about. Tell the truth, man. It's all it's all a scam. Y'all get y'all, y'all falling for the tricks. Come on, man. If you don't like the man, why you keep talking about him? 
because you know, because you know, um, he put he put he putting food on your table. Talking about you done with Brian? No, you ain't. No, you ain't. You ain't done with that man. You full of shit. You all talk no action. Come on, man. I challenge you. Y'all know who I'm talking about. I challenge you to stop talking about Brian. Excuse me. Because if you ain't got nothing good to say, why why do all that shit? Why make all these emotional ass videos? You so fucking emotional. They won the game Saturday night and you still was fucking crying. Cut the bullshit, man. Excuse the noise, but they're playing well, man. They look happy out there. And they got a little they got a little careless. But these are things that they can fix. And they can be alright. Because nobody can stop Anthony Davis. Nobody. Brian just got to just be smarter with the basketball. They gotta close out on three point shooters. They left Miles Turner open. They left Andrew open. And they paid and they paid the price, didn't they? You have to close out on three-point shooters. They might need to play a, play a zone on defense. So that way they can have pressure. So that means that the um that the guards, that the guards can put pressure on three-point shooters. That's what they can do in fourth quarters and close out on them three-point shooters. If they would have closed out on Andrew tonight. I don't know how to say his name. His name is crazy. But anyway, if they'd have closed out on Andrew, the guy who hit the game winning shot at the buzzer, they would have won this game tonight. All they got to do is execute. But coming up here every day, making all these emotional ass videos, where, where the fuck is that getting you? It makes you look weak. I'm done talking about him. No, you're not. You'll be talking about him tomorrow because you can't help it. Because you got a mortgage. You got a car. That shit. Them Brian videos putting bread in your pocket. Y'all, come on, man. Cut the bullshit, man. Y'all falling right for the tricks. Because they'll do a little video here and there. Like, they'll throw a little... They'll throw a little video talking about... um, talking about the Warriors or that throw a little something talking about you know look Kyrie Irving because you know everybody Kyrie dick riding so they throw a little Kyrie Irving dick riding video here and there but mainly you got brown balls in your mouth like 80, 85% of your videos sir making all these emotions you know you know your boy um, uh, Beg TV Mr. Donation TV, you know tomorrow that hate video coming, that hate live screen coming, you know it's coming. Or he gonna make some stupid ass video. He just like, y'all just a bunch of clowns and y'all just easy to read. You know, you ain't got nothing good to say, just don't say nothing. And I'm done, I'm done talking about them clowns, but I'm gonna say this real quick. Wednesday night, close out on them three-point shooters. Brian, go to the basket. Stop selling for them jump shots. You're power, you play power forward. They need to set up an offense to where Brian can put his back to the basket. You 260. Use your size. But I think they're going to work on it. I think they're going to be all right. But all that negativity, I'm not doing all that anymore. They can build on this tonight. Even though they lost, they played well. The game was in reach. They just got to finish and execute. That's all they got to do. But all this extra shit, we don't. You don't need to do all of that. Y'all just don't like this man, and that's all it is. Talking about well, you know, Cleveland, Miami. Them days are over. They're not in that. What is? It's all. What, what about now? He's a Laker. All this stuff about he stacked teams and man, come on, man, cut the bullshit. They could win eight games. They could win. They could win all eighty-two games, and y'all still find something to bitch about. Cause that's what y'all Lake half y'all Laker fans ain't nothing but a bunch of haters anyway. You know, it's just sad. It's just sad. I'm done with Brian. No, you ain't.
because you, you know you need that money. You need that bread. So you got to talk about Bron in a negative light because that's all people want to hear on YouTube anyway. Nobody wants to hear anything positive. Y'all don't want to hear that shit. All these so-called Bron fans, where you at? Now I'm saying something positive about them. Where y'all at? They played well tonight. I'm not going to say nothing bad. They just got to make minor adjustments. They make minor adjustments. They all right. They've been playing a lot better. And people are still bitching and crying because that's what y'all want. Y'all want something to cry and bitch about. Because that's what y'all want, man. And this shit is sad. Good game, Lakers. Y'all played well. You just got to learn how to finish and execute Friday Wednesday night. That's it, deuces.